More than 70% of the world's surface area is covered with water. Ever since, man has caught fish and seafood in the oceans. Driven by the worldwide increasing demand for seafood, a global industry has developed with more and bigger ships. Today, over 80% of global fishery resources are fully or overexploited. These maps show the expansion of world fishing fleets from 1950 onwards. To analyze their impact, scientists have calculated the primary production, PPR, of each region. PPR is a value which describes the total amount of energy that a fish needs to grow within a certain region. In areas of blue, the fleet extracted at least 10% of this energy. Orange indicates a minimum 20% extraction, and red shows at least 30%. Since 1950, the area fished by global fleets has increased tenfold. 100 million square kilometers are fished today with such intensity that these ecosystems are already severely damaged. That's around one third of the world's oceans. Today, three out of four fish stocks in Europe are overfished, and the fish caught by industrial fleets in Europe are increasingly small and fewer in number the EU fishing fleets expanded their area of fishing to healthy fish stocks overseas. Some 30% caught by EU vessels are now fished outside of European waters. Let's take a close look at the West Indian Ocean. In the blue area, European fishing fleets have extracted 10 to 20% of primary production over the last 20 years. By comparison, during the same period, the world's fleets accounted for an extraction of more than 30%, the red area. As you can see, Europe's fishing fleet is responsible for a large part of this. To summarize, three out of four European fish stocks are overfished. 30% caught by EU vessels are now fished outside of European waters. European fishing contributes significantly to worldwide overfishing. WWF calls for sustainable EU fisheries, also outside EU waters.